Oh, yeah, no. Uh, oh, 126 minutes on the battery. Oh, yeah. You're recording? Yeah, right now. Oh, you're recording? Okay. <laughs> yeah. Ten, right. ten seconds in. Definitely. Nice Hold on, not done. Not done? Okay. <laughs> it's the boobies. It's the boobies. Okay. Everybody loves them. <laughs> God, God bless America. She calls me an ass. I'm like, you know what? Hold on. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm an ass. All right. Hey, everyone, what's up? Mr. Smiles here from JSC Media. Thank you so much for tuning in to Smile TV. And I'm here with a local artist, Cassie's Hand. And we're here at the Underground Rock Shop, and we're here to take a few minutes to just oh, what things that. going on right now. Is everyone okay with it? Anywho, Cassie Hand, back to the back to the topic. That's gonna be a fun cut. But anywho, so we're here to talk a few minutes with her and have her insights on what she believes about art and what she thinks about the local venue that we're that we're having the show at. So, you ready to get started? Yeah. All right, first off, why don't you t start talking about like what type of art it is that you do? Uh, mainly painting, and I've been kind of focusing on my jewelry lately, which mm -hmm. is mainly used with old uh, recycled music instruments, uh, mm -hmm. guitar strings, um, mm -hmm. picks, simple stuff. But And then with my paintings, it's mainly... I started actually going and branching out to my oil pastels, mm -hmm. but for the most part, it's been acrylics. Okay, okay. Uh, is that the prime? That's the primary thing you like to focus on is acrylics. Yeah, any, they're easy to work with. Okay. Any particular colors that you like to focus on? Um, mine are ten, tend to be pretty dark. I usually use blacks, grays, whites, reds. Uh -huh. Just the red for a little bit of color pop, but it kind of is a reflection of myself. That's that's all I wear. Mm -hmm. Is that you know so kind of. Kind of match with each other, I guess. <laughs> okay, well, I agree. Um, after looking over some of your artwork and everything, you have a pretty sporadic uh, designs. You know, what uh, inspires you to make your uh, art? Is it any particular thing, or just um, a lot of randomness, really? Okay. <laughs> Random is pretty much all the things that I do. I find stuff, make mm -hmm. it, do what I can with it. Um, I guess that's it. <laughs> okay, well, that works for me. So we'll see you next time. No, I'm kidding. So uh, that being said, um, I've also notice you have this overly sized vagina picture. I do. And, uh, I do indeed. Yeah. Um, we're probably going to have pictures fly by of that one. Um, that one's awesome. <laughs> um, that being said, um, I saw that big picture, and uh, considering the art show that it is, I don't quite, I can't pronounce the name, and I've gotten slapped in the face for it. I can't pronounce the name, but there will be a, you have a thing that will say it. Um, it kind of matches, you know, the situation what's going on, the risque erotica mm -hmm. type thing. Um, there was a couple more paintings in there. Uh, what all do you have available uh, at the show so far? Um, at the show so far, I've got six paintings up. Um, two that I just I can't part with, so I've made prints, mm -hmm. and then some of my jewelry. Okay, okay. Um, yeah, I saw the jewelry. Yeah, I saw the jewelry. Okay, I'm yeah. making sure. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, that being said, again. Um, there's a lot of... Shut up! Well, I think that covered the situation. It's getting nasty up in here. <laughs> so, anyway, um, so that being said, there's a lot of nice uh, prominent artists on here, including yourself and everything. Mm -hmm. um, what is it that you were expecting from this shoot before you got here? Um, I don't know really what I was expecting. I knew we'd have a decent turnout just by a lot of the people who already have customer bases and mm -hmm. getting out there. That that was the main thing I really expected was just to get my name out there. That's really that's all that really mattered. You know, at the moment, that's what I'm looking for. So. Okay, then. Well, I, you got to do everything you got to do. You know, pretty you much. Had, <laughs> you had a lot of stuff up there that were pretty cool to look at. I'm sure pretty fun to play with. Not the same names. <laughs> Uh, I want to point out something. You have a piece of handcuffs, if I'm not mistaken, yes. on there. Uh, what was the, the real point of that? Uh, was, did you make those handcuffs? Is no, it, no. Um, I actually just used the handcuffs, and there's also a ball gag. That was more for just props. I also have a whip surrounding my jewelry. Again, just props. Yeah, I saw the whip, and I saw the handcuffs. I'm like, I like this one. <laughs> this one has a nice personality. It's like the donkey. I like that molder. That's a like nice molder. <laughs> So, anyway, uh, what do you look forward? What do you look forward to your art? Like, what do you want to see it turn out to be? You know, like, what do you see yourself in the long run when it comes to your art? Oh God, the long run. <laughs> yeah. Um, I don't really. I guess I don't really think too far into the future. I'm just trying to focus on now. I've got a lot of other things in my life that aren't 
solidified, so uh, the art's kind of more right now an outlet. Okay. Uh, sooner or later, I hope to branch out. I started a Facebook page. Mm -hmm. I do have an Instagram as well, as, and Facebook. But that, as of right now, that's the extent of my expansion. Okay. So, so pretty much still considered a part of that thing. Right, right. right. At the moment, online. yeah. And it's also a great way to vent. Yeah. It is. It really is. Uh, one of my prints, it's a crow, and I had... It was a really important moment in my life. That's why I just can't part with the actual piece uh -huh. and went with prints. But it was something that uh, at that time it was great for my frustrations. Anywho, unfortunately we're at that time right now. Um, is there anything you would like to say to any up and coming artists or any possible up and coming artists uh, about how to you know proceed and make it their art? I think mainly the big thing is just go for it. Mm -hmm. I mean, regardless of how your art turns out, as long as you're happy with it, that's really bad. I understand we're all critics. We're mm -hmm. really critical of ourselves. That's with almost every artist. Mm -hmm. But if you just go for it, you put it out there, mm -hmm. more people are going to see that. They're going to see that you actually put your heart and soul into it. Mm -hmm. So that's that's the biggest thing. Just go for it. I you know, I have a great support system of friends out there that have really encouraged me. Cause sure, at first, I wasn't sure if I was going to do the show. Mm -hmm. But a support system is... Definitely necessary in this business. Mm -hmm. Well, that's all I can ask is to get some support and some dedicated you know, fans and everything. Yep. And before we go, I gotta ask a couple questions. What's with the mask? I don't <laughs> actually, know you're wrong, but what's with the mask? Um, I actually borrowed it from my friend Addison. I saw it sitting at his room. And I was like, I just, I love it. Yeah, Instantly fell in love with it. Is his last name Parker? Possibly. I don't, I don't know. I think so. Yeah, um, used to hang out at Juice. Yep, I yep, know exactly yep. who you are. You've actually met me on occasion. Yep. You just don't recognize me. I'm on my first. That period. I don't know if you recognize me, but the point No, is. I... Yeah. yeah, so, anywho, <laughs> well, I thought that was more like a uh, a prop gag, you know, to say, like, right. that's right, I bring you to the cold chamber. <laughs> that's what I was thinking. But, anywho, that was Cassie. Huh? Cassie, huh? Cassie. I'm so sorry. I, I'm terrible with names. I'm keeping this in there. <laughs> All right, anyone... All right, anywho, that was Cassie Han from Des Moines, Iowa. Yep. Uh, that was Cassie Han from Des Moines, Iowa. Thank you so much for tuning in. If you want to hear more from this woman, feel free to check the description below. Thank you so much for tuning in once again. And just remember, smile and watch it. Cut.